All right. So we are back on some more Horizon. Now, in every video, I won't have commentary due to reasons, but, you know, I will try to have commentary in quite a few of them, if not most of them. So, in the last video, we did gather our materials to get some special type of armor that, you know, the, the guy was hyping up. So I'm going to try to see if they're even done making that armor. And we also found out that, you know, Silence um, captured Hades and interrogated him for information. So, yes, now we got to go get some parts so we can blast open this door. So if you're new, subscribe. If you are enjoying the content. Please hit the like button. I try to upload daily. I upload almost daily. So, yeah. Nighter. Oh, I activate it. Gather deep water kindle weed oil and gather leaf lasher spark. Please. Okay, let's use its power cell. Oh, it's in the back. Alright, this is gonna be quite. I don't remember if it said how many we needed. There's the power cell. I can tag it in my focus display. Nothing shocking, I hope. for the igniter. Now all I need is some deep water kindle. Deep water kindle. Okay. Okay, so I don't have to mess with them anymore. Got what I needed from them. Come up there. All right. 
right. Special gear. Got that. There. Should be able to use this to blow up that fire gleam now. A useful combination. It's how I detached the processing orb from the horse in the first place. Guess I didn't need Great. the oil. I'd step back if I were. Finally. I think I'm in. Then by all means, proceed. But I could use this igniter if I find more places with fire gleam. Focus on the task at hand, Eloy. I don't like the way you're talking to me. Better calm it down. There's another gene lock door on the other side. And that's where any guy backups would have been stored. Crumbling ruins while you spy on me through my focus. Stop waxing nostalgic and concentrate on finding a backup. Mm. Yeah, I don't. My pullcaster might come in handy here. Um, what is that? Make sure before I jump. That did it. Oh. Oh. I guess I'm going to need that little power cell. He's bright. That is bright. Oh, that is bright. Oh, my God. There's my eyes. What? The, I didn't. What's above me? I did not pull that out. That there's something above you. My man Ted, harbinger of the end of times. What can I do for you? Your modifications to Recluse Spider, the separate repositories for Gaia and Hades samples. Well, you also are off the charts. I'm going to move testing of the Hades protocol to Zero Dawn headquarters next week. Slow down, Haas. Let me put it to you, nursery school simple. Baby Hades is a vile little thing, and it's got to stay in his crib.
Interesting. <laughs> what is this room for? Looks like there is another console that needs power. There's a course. <sighs> this console shut down. Looks like the same device from the other room. Maybe I can use the energy cell here. Oh. Here. Oh dear. What is that one for? Hold on. What is this one for? Is another one of those audio another audio thing? Oh. Or loot. What do we have here? Don't mind if I do. Now we're gonna move this over here so we can open that door. Wait. Elizabeth and Travis Tate. just done gonna make you love me. I just imagine them far zenith rapscallions opening this fake guy we made for him. And I thought, what this really needs is a signature. This isn't a prank, Travis. I know, I know. All I did was just script a couple of avatars. A little you, a little me. To deliver our message of doom. Real personal lag. Would you just send it? As soon as it's done compiling, then you and me should celebrate. I brought party fixings, pizza rolls, absinthe, a couple of hacky sacks. I'm heading back to Bryce as soon as this is done. Hmm. Color me confounded, Liz. <laughs> How is it that someone like you, Paragon, damn near saint, we love this world so damn much, but no one in it. I mean, have you ever even had a friend? Compile complete. Data file, barren promise, ready for transmission. If you would, please. Logic bombs off. Here it comes, far as nuts. Just keeping the best of what you do, Travis. Always admire you from afar, Liz. There's another panel up there that I should Where be able to Where my mom's grave. I'll have to climb higher to reach yeah, it. she was religious. Uh, <laughs> down from the ledge. That looks pretty far. Oh, oh be careful. Huh. I didn't see that. I don't think my pole can latch on from here. I'm gonna have 
have to jump. Making me nervous. Uh, now we just fly. I can't jump. What if I try? Facility over there. And then we, we glide. What's in here? There's another locked door. What's that console next to it? Balls, dude. How loud is it out there? Outside the noise dampening field? So this is connected to the door. Wolf. He needs a code to open. Oh, great. He needs a code. wonder if this had to go. Balls, dude. How loud is it out there? Outside the noise dampening field? Wolf 50 decibels. Well, I guess we got privacy. What's the hap, Trav? You and me go back a ways. But I never saw you cheat no one. Why well, start with Farzini? I was gonna tell you about it. They get a copy of Guy, I get a spot on the Odyssey. But, but I told them, I said, make it two spots, because I'm bringing my friend Trav. Gosh, Hank! Sounds like the dampening field done slipped. You all right? No, I'm cool. Look, I got a personal field right here, see? Now, I know your ears ain't working so well just now, but see that text transcribing every word I say? Good. While I dial the music out there up to 170 decibels, how about you type in that transmit code? There you go. And that's all of it? Cool. Thank you, Hank. We're done. Security? Hank Shaw is ready for collection. No, he's still breathing. Might want to bring a spatula, though. <laughs> hmm. Oh. Data here. Uh, seven, four, eight, two. From Travis Tate. This place turned out a lot of malware before Zero Dawn took over. And one of them has a number. Oh, damn it. I forgot the code already. What was the code? Again? Seven four eight two. Okay, we started talking and I just kind of lost my train of thought. Seven four eight two. Seven four eight. There we go. Alright, this bad boy. Open. Else around here? Nope. And we climb. This music is a little creepy. Close. 
Oh, that was close. I didn't, I didn't actually think that was a... Sometimes I'll be thinking she's not gonna jump far enough. I hate to have to climb all the way back up here. Okay. No way. You gotta be you gotta be kidding me. You did not just Oh my god, she did not just do that. I knew something like that was gonna happen. How did I know that was gonna happen? <sighs> That's pretty annoying. I don't think I'm gonna get to the door from here. Jumping the way I want her to. Oh, you, you gotta be kidding me. Oh my god. Now she don't want to latch on to it. She don't want to latch on to it. What? Well, that's pretty annoying. Didn't see that there. That's why. 
Okay, so much for the flooded maze. This reckless spider thing is a testing apparatus for Gaia and Hades. I better take a look at that excess panel. Yes, get to it. He's gonna stop talking to me like that. Okay. I think those circular pods are repositories. One loaded with Hades backups, the other with Gaia. Hades is down, but the guy repository is stuck. So unstick it. Uh, I, I need to detach the cable from the arms coupling. Hades 0312, vessel corroded. Data lost. The water it looks like it destroyed them. Data lost. All of them. You don't suppose. Guy too? I didn't know I had to shoot it. Uh, just, that's just my first instinct. I got one. Two, in fact. I was starting to get worried about it. Data footprint low. 90% memory free. That can't be right. Gaia was a vast super intelligence. We really expected to shoot. Functions, but there are sub functions out there. The original ones scattered to the winds when Guy blew us up. They could be anywhere. You can't find them in time, even if you did. The mysterious signal mutated them just like Hades. You have no idea. I do. A good one. If it works. West of Plains on. Close enough for me to go get it. I was hoping to find all the sub functions, but one's enough to get started, right? It is. Recover Minerva. One could use it to launch Gaia's heuristic matrix. And when she's conscious, she helps me find the other sub functions. I go gather them. And we build her piece by piece. Very clever. Still think I can't save the world on my own? Why they're here. Friends of yours? 
No. They don't know me. The data pulse I transmitted indicated that a Gaia backup could be recovered here was anonymous. Now they're very powerful, but they won't harm you. Not when they see who you are, who you are. A clone of Elizabeth Sobek, a genetic key with which they can remove Gaia and rebuild the system. They need you. I warned you, Silence. For once, Eloy, submit to the inevitable. Open the hatch. First I rebuild Gaia, save life on Earth, then I track you down and end yours! I'm trying to help you here. There. No focus. Spyware free. Okay. Think. Think, think, think. I don't care how powerful they are. The only thing that can open that hatch is me. How many of those does she got? The question is, can I find another way out? There's a current in the water. Not much, but maybe it's a way out. Genetic profile confirmed. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sobat. Please step inside. Oh. Oh my. Whoa. What the hell? Have it? Fantastic. Did the pulse originate here? Is someone? Something wrong? Oh. Shit. Spectres, beta. Well, any idea what the hell a clone of Elizabeth Sobek is doing here? Maybe Gaia made one when it destroyed itself a Hail Mary to repair the system. Mm -hmm. Don't like the sound of that. No, don't like it. Oh don't my like god. It. But the if Nope. One's enough trouble. Eric! Yeah? Care to do a little downsizing? Hmm. Sure. What if she sent the pulse? Then that was foolish of her. But we got what we came for. So let's put it to use. Want to fight him? Yeah. I snap a lot of necks in VR. But that certain tremor, its life fades from the eyes. Ooh! No hollow quite gets it. Keep flapping your mouth. It makes a nice target. You actually think that primitive crap you got there can hurt me? Yeah, we had our lead. I'm 
about hurting him. Form collapsed, body went with it. Right. And since when don't you get what you want, huh? Spectres, search. Oh boy.
Might be a way under this. What are those specters? I better stay out of their sight. All right. I have a feeling I'm going to end up having to fight them. At least one of them. Not all. That's crazy. right here and the way you were clutching it when I found you I knew it was important where are we an outpost of the Utaru tribe not far from where you fell how long two days two days <laughs> uh, 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 
Aloy? There's no time. I found something. In the mountains west, west of Plain Song. Yeah. Kept muttering it while I carried you. Look, Aloy, whatever it is that you found, you're in no shape. To... I will crawl. If I have to. Okay, fine. But before you do that, there's someone you should talk to. An Utaru named Zo. And she told me there's been trouble in those mountains. A cave spitting out deadly machines. Can't be a coincidence, right? Well, why do we need her? Let's head for the cave. Oh. Yeah, not in your condition. It's in Utaru territory. Her territory. She can help us. We'll see. Let's go see this marvelous snow then. As wood and limbs wither, roots rot in snow, still the seed rises as certain as stone. So? She should be in bed. Aloy doesn't really do shit. Hmm. You're so right. Roll said I should talk to you. About the machines. In the mountains west of Plainsong. I am a grave singer. My place is here. We can talk once you've healed. What's wrong with it? Her. The name is Ray, not it. She's one of our land gods, and she's dying. But not just dying, she's suffering. Her condition is not your concern. So, if anyone can help, it's Aloy. May I? So what I'm about to do might look bad, but it will help. Spear. Song. No trouble out there? The Utaru have trouble everywhere. Our fields blighted, our settlements abandoned. But the cave in the mountains is the worst of it. It is a sacred place. Fa, another of our land gods, went inside weeks ago, but she hasn't emerged. Killer machines pour out instead, threatening to overwhelm us. It's never happened before. Wouldn't be your first sacred cave. Ray and other machines like her, you call them gods? Land gods, yes. For generations, they provided for us. Seeding and harvesting fields of plain song. Food for all. A miracle of endless bounty. A farm run by machines. More than a farm. A blessed land, providing sustenance for my people. Until the derangement. So what happened to the land gods after the derangement? They faltered, year by year. Once they were peaceful, now they turn on us when we approach, even attack us. 
They'd always enriched the soil, but for several seasons they've glutted it endlessly with mulch. The fields have turned fetid. A blight that keeps spreading, even beyond our lands. We used to have food for all. Now we... We barely have enough to feed our children. Must be... Over fertilization. Spread by spores, maybe. I don't know. That's not even the end of it. Each land god used to visit the sacred cave once a year, but no longer. Without the rituals of renewal, they've fallen apart. Like Ray. They're dying. And my tribe with them. So the cave is sacred because machines like Ray and the one you call Fa go inside? Yes. Before the derangement, each land god left the fields and made a pilgrimage to the cave. Always in the same order. Doe first, then Ray, then me, and so on. Spattered with soil from their labors. Each reappeared two days later, shining anew, without so much as a scratch. All soil and ornaments of worship washed away. The tribe celebrated each return as one of the eight hallowed festivals of our calendar. But the derangement changed the cycle. Yes. Or so we thought. Over time, the land gods stopped the ritual, becoming crazed and brittle. But three weeks ago, Fa trudged inside. The entire tribe lifted their voices in song, praying that the cycle had begun again. Fa has not emerged. What has our machines built to kill? Are machines being made inside? Like in a cauldron? Sounds like it. But the way these land gods come and go, it's not like anything I've seen before. You called yourself a grave singer. What does that mean? To all living things, an end must come. It is my task to ease the passage. I try to bring comfort and sing of the renewal that death sows the way for. But I never thought I would have to sing for one of our land gods. I don't even know if Ray heard me. What you did soothed her more than I ever could. It's not your fault, so Without the second sight, there's nothing more you could have done. You said the tribe has trouble with its fields and settlements. Yes. Whereas once the land gods harvested endless bounty from the fields, now they sow a poisonous blight. War brews among the Tanakh, so their rebels prowl our outskirts. And the machines grow ever more aggressive, hemming us in, forcing us to desert distant villages. Now they're even coming out of our sacred cave. Many in the tribe fear our days are dwindling. I wish I could tell you it was better everywhere else. Not that we're gonna lose hope. Thanks for taking us in. Varl's the one that carried you across the wilds. I doubt anyone else here would have let us in. Or stayed by my side to make sure Aloy was comfortable. We were lucky to find you. I could say the same thing. Sounds like you two have been spending a lot of time together. I wish it hadn't taken an injury to make that happen. I hope you feel better. And soon. I need to get into that cave. What? No one does that. Well, it's time to make an exception. It belongs to the land gods. Look, so There is something inside there. Something that could solve problems all over the world. The storms, the derangement. <laughs> Maybe even your broken land gods. What could possibly do all that? 
a spirit? Yeah. Something like that. I could journey back to Plainsong, assemble the chorus, tell how you soothed Ray, ask their permission to go inside. Great. I'll get my things. <laughs> She needs rest. You don't have to tell me. Okay, I'm fine. Assembling the chorus will take time. Heal first, then join me. Fine. Bed rest. I got it. She does not need you to help her heal. You could come with me to plain song. Lend your voice to mine as I try to persuade the chorus. It might help her cause. I'd like to, but I'm afraid she might run off. Really? Very well. Later then. So, wait. She... It's not. Uh, that I don't want to go with you. Oh, wow. It's just... <laughs> oh, my boy. Oh. Oh. That's what y'all been doing while she was out for two days. I see you, my boy. Go Is ahead and get chance? yours in. Um. Yes. And I look forward to more conversation. Oh. Mm. Uh, I think yeah. it's some of that Utaro tail, huh? You're supposed to be resting. Laurel. You should go with her. <laughs> I'll get better on my own. You trying to get rid of me so you can... this time. I'll meet up with you in plain song when I'm ready. You sure about this? Yes. Go. <laughs> Get out of here. Okay. So, wait. Oh, he was excited to leave. Hmm. Who are these clowns? Who are they? Actually, have some skills points to use, and quite a bit of them. That. Chain master. Oh, yes. Heart Spike trap. Hmm. Or by using a heavy.
Okay. Let's go into Survivor. Earn three connected skills. Got that one. That one. Place traps fast down the field. Alright, we, we're done. Now this the dangers out. of the hunt require quality gear. You got. I can upgrade any of these yet. Surge water trap. Vertical shock trap. Selling today. So Ray. Somehow it's docile. Part of its programming, maybe? I need to move all in zone and plain song. Ask the chorus if we can go into their sacred cave. Many of us should be inside. If I can get it, I can reboot Gaia. Campfire near. Or maybe we can figure out who those strangers in the proving lab were. But first, I might want to explore a little. See what I can find in this area. Is that the Tomek. Thing? If I overlight it, I can get data on the surrounding area. Where's the tall neck? Red, you won't believe what I've got. Oh, there it is. this away for later. Oh, Looks boy. like a satellite dish. If I can climb it, I should be able to reach that tall neck easily enough. Got to get rid of that scraper and this... Teach me how to override these machines. 
Alright, take it down once it slides to the land. I need to take that thing out first. Wait till it lands again. Things can one shot you. Use this tail to shoot at me if I break it first. There has to be a way out of this thing. The scrapers can one shot you. No uh, room on me. It's into my stash. Now be careful. I did not know the scrapers. One shot you. Power generator. That looks dead. To be honest, that's actually my first time dying in this game because I've been playing. My very first time dying and it was because of that. battery console Around and turn the way up. 
right here. Power cell. Disconnected from the main power line. We should get that generator below the dish going. There's the generator. Let this power cell be running. Power's back. I should check that console I found earlier. The console. Oh, it's probably up there. I'll probably want to do the tall nicks. Every video. I'll probably do them off screen. Let's see what this thing does. And look. Tonics every. You know. I ain't gotta worry about that. Oh, so it's moonlight. So they're still following their programming. Even though it's killing everything. Yeah, you might as well hang it up. Y'all feel it.
song. I guess. What kind of armor they got? There's Laurel and Zoe. Hit that. I don't, don't want to check something out real quick. So if you made it this far and you enjoyed the video, please consider the like button. Subscribe if you are new and make sure you turn on that noti bell so you don't miss out on daily Horizon uploads. With that being said, I hope to see y'all in the next video. Bye.